After having just finished a very stressful week that was just non-stop, a trip to the mountains was exactly what the doctor ordered. And I feel way more energized and ready to continue and tackle what I got to do next. Let's see how it feels. So refreshed. And nervous. Refreshed and nervous. She's studying for boards. We'll see no, you back in. Oh yeah. It's just money though. Oh, and I'm gonna be kind. We're gonna be kind to the people no matter what. Yep. It's just money. I'm I'm feeling okay about it. Um I'll see you back in Dallas and I'll let you know if I made it on with a carry on or not. Or if we had to pay hundred and fifty dollars. See you soon. Luckily we made it out okay. We got home this morning around two AM. Didn't have to pay bags, it was a tight fit, but we made it work. Uh, as much as I wanted to like Frontier Airlines, I don't think it's for me. I'm visiting Louisville Lake, so it's about an hour drive outside of Dallas, just to kind of lean into that discomfort. being able to see a family go by so that was cool i'm sure it helps that i'm off today and that i'm in the woods again today but oh my goodness i'm gonna ruin the shot the setup on the camera but you have to see this i don't think i was able to depict that very well but it's a mama deer and her little baby deer and i'm just eating hey don't don't mind me you do. Being out in the woods, out in the mountains, it really energized me. It was exactly what I needed to re-energize and get pumped up. This vlog is all about the most important thing I've ever done. And if you haven't put together based on the other two initial vlogs, as cheesy as it is, I would say the best and most important thing I have ever done for myself is, although I'm still in the process of learning to love myself, accepting who I am for who I am, and just who I am as me. I was born this way. And just that acceptance alone has helped me grow in many aspects of my life. Just taking time for myself to take care of myself. Honestly, that, for example, is what led to my diagnosis of ADHD. I've never cared or almost felt uh, guilty as if in thinking, you know, people have it worse than I do, why should I go get checked? And sure enough, I'm like 
textbook definition of it um, if you haven't picked up on that so this is just beautiful I love it here all right let's start heading in for this interview wish me luck the interview actually went very well and the reason I wanted to take it in the first place was because it was something that made me uncomfortable not just the interview process but the whole situation and why I'm doing it and uh, all that good stuff but more on that later I'm gonna take a quick climbing break I feel like I deserve that much so I didn't like the ending of this video so I'm reshooting it because I can do that so I want to leave you with this by me saying that the most important thing I've ever done is to accept myself for who I am that's not me saying that there's not an there's no room for improvement because there definitely is and I'm enjoying the process of becoming that better version of myself and I think accepting myself for who I am is the first step because this person I am today is going to affect the person I am in the future. As I've said before, this is a journey of self-love, one that we're doing together. I hope you join me in developing courage to be yourself, bet on yourself, and to take big swings, you know? Maybe the only thing that's holding you back is you. Thank you.